It covers 73 yards. Palomalo just jumped the center. <laughs> 35 yarder. Up and good. But hang on. We get a penalty. Camp Chancellor jumped about 12 feet in the air. <laughs> Watch Camp Chancellor. <laughs> he comes hurdles. And then I don't know how he misses it. That's legal. That's not leaping where you can't put your feet on the defenders. He does it. He clears them. It's incredible. Graham Gano got that football. He did. He gets back there and he blocks it. It's wide. Did he get a piece of it? Unbelievable. We get a penalty too. Such tremendous athleticism. And there's the running into the kicker. Terry McCauley called it. Unbelievable. He's got to have the snap count, right? How else can you, can you time it like that two times in a row? To make it a six-point game. Look at Collins leaping over that. Of course, the ball would be in play now under the new rules, but it's out of bounds. Look at this. We first saw this with Cam Chancellor, I believe it was, with Seattle in the playoffs maybe a year ago. If he makes contact with any of those offensive linemen, a potential victory. They have a new snapper in Alan Brewer. And Whoop. wouldn't you know it, another problem, a flag down. It's Bobby Wagner who comes in, but you have a penalty marker. If he just touches the helmet or anything else of that center, which yeah. he did right there, right. that little toe tap is going to cost him if the official saw it. And the left foot on the numbers of the snapper. Holding down the guard. There's no foul for an illegal formation by the defense. First down. Made 35 straight field goals. They jump the center, and it's blocked by Shea McClellan. McClellan goes over the top of Morgan Cox. That's a clean block. What a play by McClellan. Rookie kicker. Simmons blocked it. Running back with it is Parks. Down the sideline. Parks takes it all the way back. The Broncos have taken the lead on a blocked extra point run back. Simmons, the rookie, 